And you want one with the other one? Good too? morning. Yeah, just to. I've been doing things double, just in case one don't work. I'm not. I don't like these digital. Things. I like your shirt. Camera, so. I'll take one with this. I got four cameras here. You want to sit down, Pop? No, I, I'm okay. I'm better off as move around a little bit. I, I, okay. It's still time this year. He uh, worked at White Rogers, and then right towards the end of the war, he got into the, uh, joined the Navy, and he is the Grand Marshal this year. Now I will uh, turn the mic over to uh, Mike Hano, and he will give a, uh, the history of the flag. All right, we're going to... Uh, have Sherry here sing our national anthem to get started. Then I'm going to turn the mic over to her. And if you want to join in, feel free. Please do join in because I'm not the usual singer. <laughs> oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we enable us to be better patriots, true citizens, and more loyal Americans. To thy glory and to thy honor of this great nation. Amen. Amen. Okay. That we may better understand the meaning of our flag, I call upon my brothers for the history of the flag. Hail great is as old as the human race. The carrying of banners has been custom among all peoples in all ages. These banners usually contain some concept of the life or government of those who fashion them. The evolution of the American flag marks the progression of the government of the American 1818. The number of stripes should be 13, and that the blue field should carry one star for each of the 20 states in the Union, and that a new star should be added for each state thereafter admitted. Since 1818, there has been no change in the flag design except that 28 new stars were added before July 4th, 1912. And this flag, this flag of the 48 stars flew over the nation for 47 years until just before the Vietnam War. On July 4th, 1959, a star was added for Alaska, our first non-connected state, and a year later, Hawaii, our island state, added a 50th star. Our present flag, 50 stars and 13 stripes. For millions of poor and oppressed refugees abroad and stands as a promise that the underprivileged will not be forgotten. What is the meaning of the flag of the United States? There can never be a definite answer to that question. There are people who, in this world who see it as a symbol of imperialism. Others see it as a destiny of the people. But reference to these and similar views of the flag were resolved by Rudolph Wilson when he said, This flag, which we honor and which we serve, is the emblem of our unity, our power, our thought, and shape of this nation. It is no other character than which we give it from generation to generation. The choices are ours. <clears throat> Only true love, true love of our fellow man can create peace. The emblem of token that is love is the stars and stripes, the symbol of America, a way of life. Our fathers, God, to thee, author of liberty, to thee we sing, long may our land stand be bright with freedom's holy light. Protect us by thy might, great God, our King. Lodge Esquire, how shall we further honor our flag? The flag is formally honored by the Pledge of Allegiance. This pledge was written in the 1890s of America, made a principle of charity, justice, brotherly love, and fidelity, ever increase in each of us. I now declare the ceremony over. Thank you all for attending and have a good day.
Spongebob! That's a long ride in that little thing, I bet. Yeah, it is. 